Hi guys, my name is Mukudze Kandoro Majoni. I'm a comedian uh, and all around content creator. Uh, you might know me from Zimbabwe's biggest podcast, Sadza in the Morning, uh, which just recently discontinued uh, after five years. I think as it stands, podcasts have uh, quite an unfair advantage over most forms of content production because of the intimacy they bring. So you find that with podcasts, it's actually, for somebody to listen and tune into a podcast, it's actually a choice where they are going to search up the name of a podcast that they've heard or they've been recommended and they are listening to it. You don't stumble upon a podcast. So when a video is viral, you know, people stumble it because it's being retweeted or it's being shared or it's being posted all over the... Nobody is posting hour long, like... An hour-long podcast cannot go viral the same way a video or a tweet goes. So, when somebody, when say, when somebody or somebody's are consistently choosing, you know, your podcast to listen to it week in, week out, and recommending it to other people, you know, that level of intimacy is something that most people would die and kill for. In in, 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 in the creative business. Uh, in the last few years, there's been a lot of new platforms that host podcasts. Uh, for us, we used uh, a South African voice platform called Iono, uh, ionofm.com. Uh, there's Anchor, there's Podbean. There's a lot, there's a lot. They, they, they're a diamond dozen, you can find them. One of the biggest lessons that we learned is you 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 ha- you, you have to have patience because it's it's not a it's not a get rich quick scheme, you know. You're going to be in there for a very long time uh, until you start seeing tangible benefits, you know. So you 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 have to have the long game in mind uh, when you're doing podcasts. I think finding something that you enjoy uh, talking about makes the whole thing easier because the thing that makes a podcast good is the consistency and you can only be consistent if you enjoy what you're talking about. So you have to find if you enjoy talking about cars, if you enjoy talking about politics, you know, Makua, if that's your thing, then I would suggest, you know, you lean over your strength. It's definitely an audience. Anybody who listens or loves radio is going to love a podcast because a podcast is just a radio show without that whole nyore, nyore, Zimbabwe, yeah, without all the adverts, annoying ads and all that. But yeah, it's I think it's a pretty cool way of connecting with people. Zimbabweans of late, there's been a growth in the number of podcasts that are being created and just in the number of people that are interested in podcasts because they realize the thing that it's different from like you know a, a radio show if it's happening on radio if you miss it at 8 a.m you've missed it for that day and with the podcast you can pause rewind replay it share it you know save it for a specific moment and it's, it's that level of intimacy so yeah um there's definitely an audience for not just in zimbabwe but in africa podcasts i think that have been growing and very exciting to see where where, where this whole thing goes